Right guys, welcome back to another episode of the Pez Become a Legend with Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. and lads. It is the season finale. Um, I've made a decision. The league is won. We've seen the title celebrations. You know, what they were. I, I'm still... They, I was unimpressed with them, so I'm still slightly disappointed with that. But, why is my controller playing up? We're going to have to swap controllers here, lads. Um, so, yeah. We're going to have to plug in a wee wire here. Great start. Um, basically, um, the crack is... Because we already seen the title celebrations and stuff, I don't need to play Stoke, right? So I'm gonna send that game right here, right now. I should have checked my goal contributions. It's a 2 2 draw. As you can see, the league was won. 37 goals. I think I scored one. I think I've scored one there now. Team of the season has been announced. We're in it. Come on, lads. Doing absolute bits. The national team squad announcement. So, oh, congratulations. You won the Premier League. We were named the Premier League's most valuable player. We were named Premier League top goal scorer. So we won the golden boot. Picked for Premier League team of the season. And we're in the Portugal squad. Oh my, what a start, lads. What a start to the episode. But obviously we're here for one game, and one game only. And that is the Champions League final, lads. Now, we have, do we have international games in this episode too? I forgot to check that. We're in the starting lineup. Oh, here it is, lads. The cutscene. I mean, is it just the same as every other <laughs> um, Champions League cutscene? We got that at the start of the tournament and for... Yeah, it's just the same. Got it for the knockout stages too. Oh, yeah, we have two friendlies, lads. Um, schedule. We play... We play England and we play Spain. I mean, I might play them if I'm on the bench, lads. If I'm playing left-back, I will not be playing it. But lads, here's the crack. It's Ronaldo Jr. against Messi. It's Liverpool against Barcelona. It's the Champions League final. A loss today means we'll be going home empty-handed. But a win, a win will mean we've achieved the impossible. Come on, lads, let's go. You can see Messi, Martial, Luis Suarez. But we've got Cristiano Jr. It's the Champions League final, lads. Let's get into it. Lads, this is it. The Champions League final. The ultimate stage. This stadium's called Look at the Trophy. Obviously, this was licensed in Pez 2018. Uh, James Milner is captain. Messi is captain. Both teams at this time had five Champions League titles. Obviously, Liverpool have six in real life now. We've got Mignolet and goals, Trent's playing. There's the trophy. And Cristiano Jr. His dad has been on this stage many times. Can he deliver on the big stage? Scary stuff, lads. This is scary, scary stuff. Look at the teams. Look at the quality on the pitch. We're in our second season. Last season we were roughing it out in Portugal at Portimonense who, while they had a good start, were nowhere near good enough. And then all of a sudden Liverpool sold Firmino and a spot opened up for us. Now we find ourselves in the Champions League final, lads. Against Barcelona, let's go! Let's go, lads, come on. Look at this. Crazy. And this this Barcelona team's even crazier. But, lads, it's time. We've kicked off the Champions League final in 
No, Shakira, you have to pass today, mate. You have to pass today. It's the Champions League final and you're seriously messing about like that. Yeah, yeah, too ready to whip it in. I was up. It struck. It struck again. And it's just wide. The support though, we play it to Kante. Who plays it back to us. We oh, tried to cross it over to Salah. Barcelona drop. What a save. Kante. 1-0. Come on the lads. <laughs> Unbelievable save from Ter Stegen from my shot. Mix up in the Barca defence. They didn't get it cleared. Ter Stegen saves our shot. Kante with the rebound. 1-0. Unbelievable. Why that's not cleared by PK, I don't know. Ter Stegen with a good save. I should be scoring that. Listen, Golo Kante, who puts us 1-0 up in the Champions League final. Oh, Barcelona coming back with strikes. Plays it to me. We're going to play it to James Milner. Who plays it back to us. Get in the box, lads. We get the cross into Toure. Such a weak header, yeah, yeah. Hendo pumps it forward. We're trying to get onto it. Please keep it in. Because if this goes out, could be the end of me. Shakiri, pass it to me. You did. Oh, it's wide. It's, it's that time in the match where I've been subbed off in the Champions League final. I've been subbed in the Champions League final, lads. We've choked in the final. Uh, it's, I don't want to be upset or annoyed because if things go well, we're still about to win the Champions League here. But we choked big time. We had no chances, really. We couldn't score. Yes, we played a part in the lead up to Kante's goal, but there it is, though, lads. We win the Champions League 1 0. How nice it would have been. To, to have been on the pitch like look we're not well, there we are now I was going to say if we're not even celebrating then that is so harsh we are now let's go lads on the bright side this can't be the last time that we're in a Champions League final but this here is sick I've never seen that before look at us we're celebrating in the stadium Shakiri, who are you to celebrate with us you never passed to me mate James Milner, the captain, being lifted up. Do we get to see a proper trophy celebration in this one? Because, like, yeah, well, I mean, it's something. Let's go, lads. Cristiano Jr. Oh, he's going to lift it. He's going to hold it. He's a Champions League winner. He's a Champions League winner, lads. Um, I would make that the thumbnail, but I'm not going to for two reasons. One... It spoils the end of you know, clickbait and all that. Two, he's wearing a blue bib. Like, it just looks bad. But James Milner celebrates. Champions League winners. Yeah, yeah, it's Crazy. Crazy, crazy, lads. Lads are happy. We're still running around. I didn't expect this to... Uh, the last so long, but you know what? I'm gonna watch every minute of it. I want to enjoy myself here. I think that's it. That is it. What rating did I get? 6.5. Can't they got the 8 for the goal? Um, but yeah, so the final Liverpool win the Champions League. We are 81 rated still. Um, it'll be interesting. Team of the month, we're not actually in it for me, but it'll be interesting to see. Am I starting in these 
international games and where am I starting? Congratulations, you won the Champions League. You're in the starting lineup. Where am I starting? If I'm still starting left back, then I'm not playing them. Where am I starting? I'm starting right wing. Come on, lads. Right, that's it. We're going into it. Lads, England, in a friendly, but it's a big game. There's our teammate Hendo, Klein, all the boys. We finally get the start for Portugal and in a good position too, right wing. Right winger here, aren't they? But I've put the pressure on. I've won it. Cristiano Jr. scores against England. Look. Flops in the Champions League final, can't score. Comes out here and scores. Am I wearing number 11 now for Portugal? <laughs> I'm wearing number 11 now, crazy. But we're 1 0 up, we've got the goal. Brilliant lads, important, important. Just for ourselves, well, it's not really important, like, but you know, nice to score for your country, I suppose. Oh, it's a beautiful ball into us. Oh, we put it wide. Still haven't quite mastered that angle from the left-hand side. Good chance. We'll ball over the top. We win the header. It's played back to us. It's lovely football. And it's 2-0. And it's 2 for ourselves. Beautiful play. That was actually like a great bit of build-up play. A great bit of football. Look, we call for it, we head it into our teammate, he plays it straight back to us, we use our strength and we finish past the, the England goalkeeper, 2-0 up lads. We're waiting for that run, it's played out to our dad, it comes through to us, looking for a hat trick and Ronaldo Sanchez squeezes it in for a third. Brilliant goal, 3 0 up, lads. You'd love to see it. Um, I'm probably not showing too much of these um, friendlies. I'll not be showing too much of Spain friendly either if I play it because um, I, like there's no need. So I might just show like goals and any big personal highlights from myself for play. And we can't finish. That's it lads, 3-0 win against England, um, we're going to see quickly what was our match rating. We got an 8.0 and man of the match lads, good performance. Lads, we've gone straight into the Spain game, we are starting again, we are starting right wing, so yeah, again, going to just run through it um, now just to end the season you know these games aren't important as i say and i'm only gonna continue to play big friendly games simply because well maybe we're getting to the point there's our dad with a shot maybe we're getting to the point now where our place in the national team is kind of secured the starting place whereas when we were on the bench we had to keep playing games so that we could come on and make the difference our dad's taking the corner whips it into us it's gone in I'm not even getting the goal, it's going down as an own goal for De Gea. And I also noticed me, so ourselves and our dad, Ronaldo, have swapped numbers. He's now number 18 and we took his number 11. De Gea like tips it on the post a bit. Should be my goal in my opinion. We've been robbed again but what can you do? 1-0 up lads. Same to our dad, Ronaldo. It's 2-0, he gets the goal. Um, he's not even doing his own celebration, he was too close to the net. So, 2 nil, lads. Uh, give it back to us, no, he chips it in. Someone gives it to us, and we get the goal. That was such a stupid layoff that he didn't need to do. But we'll take it. We get the goal, we score again for Portugal. You love to see it, it's great. Uh, Rafa off for Bernardo Silva. 
and I thought I'd gone off there too, and then got the 3 0 off. Any Esther's come on. That's it, lads. 3 0 win. Um, we've beaten England 3 0, we've now beaten Spain 3 0. Two great performances. We get man of the match again. 8.0, same as our dad though, but that is our games finished for the season, lads. So, lads, we've been selected in the World Selection um, All Star squad, so that's unbelievable. Is that another game for us to play? When is that? Um, competition info. What is it it wants me to check? Off-season match, World Selection Challenge, participating players, Neuer, Vidal, Messi, our dad, Ronaldo, Hazard, Neymar, Suarez, Bale, Ronaldo Jr. Crazy. I bet, when does that take place, lads? What do you mean? I just checked. So we play United. And it doesn't want me to check this. I don't know what it's on, lads. Um, when is it? When is this game? It's right here, lads. I'm gonna have to play that game. I'm going to have to play that game. Wow, I cannot believe this, lads. Um, national team squad announcement. Yep, we're selected again, but please don't be between now and the end of the season. I can't be bothered playing with it. Um, we're going to get our club ranking update here also. So, where are Liverpool? Surely we're bound to be near the top now. We won the Champions League. Club ranking update has been updated. Um, your efforts this season has earned the club a place in the Champions League next season. We're going to be competing in next month's Champions Shield North America. Yes, but we might not be there, lads. Of course, we're at that stage now. The season's going to finish after this game. Um... So we play this game. Am I even in the starting lineup with that team? There's no way I am. I'm on the bench today. So today's the day. You're playing for the World All-Stars and the World Selection Challenge. Do us proud, you hear? So I'm going to jump into it now because I'm on the bench, lads. And then we can finish the season. There's obviously one thing we're all waiting for, and that's the transfer. So let's go into this, lads. So lads, this is actually quite cool. We're playing at Old Trafford for the World Selection Squad. If we get on, like, our dad Ronaldo is captain. Controversial, because Messi's also in the team. But then, look at that team. That is absolutely ridiculous. I'm not sure why United have been chosen. Because I've seen this on other people's channels. And I assumed it was the winners of the Champions League. Now... That would be Liverpool, so us playing against Liverpool wouldn't really work, would it? But then Barca were the runners-up. And United were runners-up in the Premier League, but it's not always an English team. Because I've seen Chani Sports played Napoli. Like, where did that come from? I've absolutely no idea where this, like, comes from. Will we even get on the pitch? I don't know. We'd have to replace Gareth Bale, Neymar or Ronaldo. Even Messi's playing out of position. He has to play midfield because of this. Absolutely crazy. Um, there's half time. It's nil-nil. You'd expect us to be doing better with the players that are in the squad. Are we in the game yet, maybe? Have we come in? Yeah, we have. We've come in right wing. Who have we came on for? Gareth Bale. Crazy. What ball in behind. I didn't even call for that. And we score for the World Selection Squad. Unbelievable stuff. We've just come in. 
Um, we're now being called one of the best players in the world. And we managed to score. I did not call for that ball. That's the crazy thing. That shows the quality of players in this squad. That I didn't have to call for that ball. And you did! <laughs> Come on! 2-0. Since we came off the bench, two goals. Unbelievable. What a header. We're on the hill then and we're 2 0. After going to That's it. We win 2 0 in the World Selection squad. That's been madness. Came off the bench for Bale and won 2 0. What's our rating? Surely, man, a match. Yep. 8.0. Come on. So, lads, it's the final day of the season now. As you can see, we've mastered heading, which is great. Now, I'm already thinking what I want to do next, and it's not a skill. I think it would be smart to learn the right wing position. Because we've been getting played there a lot for the likes of Portugal and stuff. It's only going to take 42 days to learn. That's great. That's not long at all. So we're going to go to next season now. And this is the big moment, lads. The new season coming in. And obviously that means transfers. But look how we ended. 81 rated. Crazy club records. Now, obviously, we had a lot more games in last season, but we've done so much better. In Portugal, five goals, two assists, and nine appearances. There's the relegations and promotions. Wolves, North, Sunderland going down. Brighton, Burnley, and Watford come back up. The 2019-20 season is underway. That's what we're in in real life, or what we should be in. It's kind of a put on hold, obviously. Um... So yeah, lads, we know what time it is. It's time for a transfer request. And we know exactly where we want to go to. Real Madrid. Now first, I want to take a look into something. Oh, you know what, lads? We might be all right, because their attacking options aren't great. The two wingers for a start, 80 and 81. Bale's not a striker at 82, Benzema's down to 84, and their options on the bench are very low. See, I was thinking I might have to change my preferred position to left wing to be able to move here if the centre forwards were too high rated. But I think we can go for it, lads. So let's transfer request to Real Madrid. Now, if that doesn't work, I am going to change my preferred position to um, left wing and see if that makes a difference. But, because we really want to go here, but let's see. We have an international friendly against France, are you joking? And then the starting lineup. Is it? It's just a friendly, yeah? <laughs> it's just a friendly, isn't it? Yeah, it's just a friendly. And then that's a friendly. And then we have the tournament with Liverpool that we might not even be at. So we're going to send the friendlies. What do we have? Like five goals, two assists. We win 4-1. And we scored. Very nice. Um, But we're focused on transferring at the minute, lads. Come on. Seriously? I'm in the starting lineup again. I don't care. I just want to find out. Am I moving to Real Madrid? It's a nil-nil draw. That's all right. I don't want to start this tournament with Liverpool, lads. I want to move to Real Madrid. Negotiation day. The negotiations with Real Madrid went really well. Once you make the decision, the transfer can be completed. Come on. List of offers. Real Madrid. One year contract, that's perfect. That's all we're gonna stay for. And lads, contract, signed a contract, it's planned. So hopefully, yes, 
Transfer to Real Madrid will be confirmed. Let's go, lads. Following our dad's footsteps into the Real Madrid team. Unbelievable. Oh, we're also in this tournament for Real Madrid. That's sick. Oh, here we are. In the Madrid dressing room. We're number seven already. We're number seven already, they know. Real Madrid no lads. National team ranking has been updated. Welcome to Real Madrid. We're also in that champion shield Asia. That is class lads. Now we'll have to check this national team ranking of course. They make us we're the best national team in the world. Oh my word, where are Real Madrid on the club rankings? Second, we've jumped up one, that's great. And there's hopefully our next team, top Juventus. But lads, let's go into player menu. First, let's look at preferred number. We are number seven. We can't change it apparently, but I don't care. We That's what we would have asked for, seven. That is crazy, lads. But lads, that's it for today's episode. And basically, quick thing before we, um, you know, leave things. This season's going to be a lot quicker. Because Real Madrid, La Liga is kind of a two, sometimes three horse race. Real, Barca, possibly Atletico. So in the league, there's only like four or five teams we're going to play. Barca, Atletico, um... Maybe Villarreal, Valencia, you know, um, Sevilla maybe. So I haven't done the, the kits for the for the teams in La Liga other than Real Madrid. But Barca, Valencia and Atletico are all licensed. And I'm not doing the kits, lads. And that's why. Because we're hardly going to be playing the teams. It's going to be like t big five games. Champions League games, that's it lads. So the season will go quicker, but we've made it to Real Madrid. I'll change I'll make sure all the team names are correct. Um I've done them all except for the teams in Segunda Division coming up. I'll have to sort them. But lads, that is the end of today's episode. We'll be back in the next episode with probably just the pre-season tournament. And then we'll be into the season with the Real Madrid as number seven lads. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time guys. Cheers.